there, welcome back to my channel. I never say that and whenever I watch other people's videos and they always sound very professional like welcome back to my channel. I just thought I would test it out. I don't know if it's going to stick but anyway I hope that you've all had a fabulous Christmas and today we're going to be testing out some Primark makeup. We have two of their new double dimension highlighters. These look stunning like I'm so excited to test them out. We also have a super matte liquid lipstick. I have tried one of the super matte liquid lipsticks out before but it was a super light shade and I didn't like the formula like one bit so I thought I would try one of their darky shades out uh, which is why I went for a super like vampy kind of purple uh, just to see if the formula was any more agreeable because I know that you know super light nude uh, colours can be really tough to formulate um, in liquid lipstick so I just thought let's give them another chance and see how the darker shade is a matte metallic liquid lipstick I've not tried any of these out before uh, but I just thought well metallic kind of lip products are really kind of in at the moment and I don't really feel like I've tried that many so I thought why not let's give this bad boy a go all of this makeup is super cheap all of it's under like three pounds so we're going to begin today with the super matte liquid lipstick take two if this one sucks balls then there'll be no more there'll be no more chances so as i said oh no i didn't say did i this <laughs> sorry guys so this is in the shade kiki as in fecking kardashians i've already ranted about the kardashians so i'm not going to rant again but i just really like i said in my other video which i think was my primark haul every single morning every single one of the kardashians including rob should be bowing down to kim and saying thank you kim for sucking that basketball player off taking one for the team selling that sex tape so that we could all be raking in the cash every single day i mean really so anyway this is kiki Okay, so I'm really liking the shade. This isn't typically the kind of shade I would go for, but I'm loving it. I don't really love the wand though. Oh my gosh, this is a, a problematic wand. This is quite tricky. Okay, so I've had this on for a couple of minutes now just to let it dry. Um, it went on really, really nicely. Uh, although I got a little bit of my teeth, but that's my fault, not the liquid lipsticks fault i love the shade um it does seem to be like maybe drying i'd say a little bit patchy feels oh, as dry as a nun's vagina like literally oh and it keeps coming off of my teeth can you see that oh my gosh like it feels so dry right now my lips are just dying they're dying i mean i love the shade um, I love the shade, especially from back here. I feel like up close you can see just how dry it's making my lips, uh, which is exactly the same issue that I had with the lighter shade. It just kind of emphasised every single line on my lip. Let's just do the kiss test. Is it going to be transfer proof? I can't say that, transfer proof. Okay, so we do have a little bit of transfer going on there. Unfortunately, um, this isn't any better than the lighter shade it's, it's sad I know but it's not like it's super super drying on my lips and I feel like look can you see all of my lines okay no sorry guys it's not for me I am feeling very confident now to say I could not recommend the super matte liquid lipsticks by Primark in my experience I don't know maybe it's just because I've got loads and loads of lines on my lips but I've not really had this issue with any other liquid lipsticks that I wear so yeah for me hard pass hard pecking pass okay so I'm going to just leave this on my lips I'm going to test out the fabulous looking highlights uh, these may not even be fabulous on my face but I mean they looked fabulous when I oh oh Shania Twain I almost dropped it I mean really okay yeah so when I swatched them they looked so good like okay so we've got lilac dreams here and we have peach shimmer here and the packaging by the way I mean it feels very cheap 
Um, but I love, like, I don't know if you're going to be able to see, but it's like hollow, you know, like the writing's hollow. But anyway, so let me do the swatches. We're going to begin with Peach Shimmer, which is this beautiful uh, peach shade, as the name would suggest. So this, oh gosh, is this not beautiful? Like, look at that. Oh my gosh, guys, look at that wet look sheen. Look at the beautiful peach. It's almost got a little bit of, a, I'd say, like gold to it as well. They pulled down my pants and exposed my vagina because that is a beautiful, beautiful highlight. I mean, I'm, I, I know on the face it could not be good, but on the hand it's great. Like, if it's crap on the face, I'll just walk about with it on my hand all day. Just like, hello, hello, hello. I mean, I'll become a, like a car park attendant kind of person where I like have to show people where to park and I'll just be like, hello, over there, or up there. I don't know why people would be parking up there, but they might be, I don't know. They might be in a high rise car park or, but anyway, that's what I shall do. Okay. Okay. So let's go into Lilac Dreams. This is what it looks like in the pan. I keep getting distracted by the fecking liquid lipstick on my teeth right now I mean okay so I will swatch this there it is looking all beautiful on my finger but watch this are you ready for a magic trick just think of me as like what's that magician guy called I have no idea I don't know who he is but I'm that magician guy you know the one I mean. He made Big Elephant disappear and the, he made lots of things disappear. That's me right now. Okay. Okay, so this is Lilac Dream. Um, let me just put a little bit more on because I really want you to see the magic trick. Okay, so if I put some more on. Okay, are you ready for the magic trick? Okay, so if I put my hand like this, it looks like I've got like nothing on there. Like here, can you see it? But watch this, ba -bow. Did you see that? I mean, really? Okay, so watch again. I've got nothing on my hand. No, I don't have anything on there, ba -bow. Like really, like really, I love it. A highlighter that does magic. Let me put a little bit more on. Honestly, I could do this all day. I had to put a little video on Instagram of the magically appearing highlight. I don't think it's coming off so well on camera and you're probably at home just thinking, oh my gosh, this is the worst magic trick I've ever seen in my life. Look, nothing's there. ba -bow. Anyway, I know, because, because look, you can see the peach shimmer, but can you see this one? Can you see Lilac Dreams? ba -bow. You can now. Okay, so first I'm going to actually go for peach shimmer and I'm going to apply this over to this side. Uh, so, if I just pop a little bit on my brush, I've really taken to enjoying applying my highlight with this little brush. I don't know why, but I feel like you can be quite exact with where you put it all. So, if you can see, like, you know, my face looks a bit messed up there. I attempted the vamp stamp today and it went terribly wrong. I attempted it yesterday, just before I was about to wash my makeup off. And I did it like the most perfect I've ever done any winged liner ever. It looked so great. I took like a million photos. So I was feeling full of confidence, thinking, right, today I'm going to surprise everyone with like a winged eyeliner. Did it go right? No, it didn't. It was fecked up. It looked terrible. So that's why it destroyed my eye makeup today. It's a very sad story, I know. Okay, let's do this. So this is a peach shimmer. guys it's so beautiful it is so beautiful it's like a kind of lighter orgasm by nars kind of shade it's definitely very peach it's got gold in it as well um oh my gosh i just i love this look at that oh god damn god damn i am loving it i feel like this would also double up as being like a really nice shimmery blush you know if you just use like a light hand and you just wanted to have like a pop of pink glow on your cheeks i feel like you could definitely use it for that <sighs> guys i'm loving it that is a huge win for me definitely recommend so we're going to move on to the magic trick 
literally the magic trick. I could have a magic trick on my face. I didn't think that would ever happen, but today, it might be the day, you'll see me on YouTube just like, I'll have a new channel and win the magician and I'll just be like putting highlight on my face just like, hello, can you see it? Can you see it? Can you can't see it? No, you can see it now. You'll be like, oh my gosh, she's gone crazy. We always knew this was going to happen, guys. We knew it. Okay, so I'm going to use my unicorn fan brush to apply this. I just, I'm having a bit of a crazy day, right? Let me show you what, why. This is why I'm crazier than usual. Oh, Shania Twain, the highlight's going everywhere. Okay, so I picked up this energy drink. It's called Ten Zing, and it's meant to be like an all-natural energy drink. So, you know, like Red Bull has like loads of crap in it. This one is claiming to be all-natural. Let me read out the list of ingredients. Green tea, green coffee, green coffee? I didn't even know there was green coffee. Garania, Himalayan rock salt in my drink lemon juice and beet sugar beet sugar i mean really so that's why i feel like it, it sent me a little bit wacky today uh, so please excuse that but we know who we have to blame tenzing tenzing over there with its six quality ingredients i mean really so anyway back to the highlight you're thinking i'm gonna just get on with the fucking highlight i mean really i know i'm sorry guys okay so i've got a little bit of this on my brush let me get my mirror. Okay, so I can't really see all that much. I'm actually going to switch to my other trusty brush. Not saying that I don't like the fan brush, I do. It's just that I think I like this one a little bit better right now. Um, also, what was I going to say? Ah. Oh, liquid lipstick on my teeth of course that's no surprise that's what i was going to say look i switched my nose ring in my nose and it's totally got infected like it feels like it's throbbing and it's just i was freaking out about it this morning i was thinking oh my god my nose is going to fall off on christmas day i'm filming this on christmas eve today okay yes christmas eve i should be wrapping presents i know but i've got makeup to try i mean really i mean really so anyway okay so what are we thinking i can't really see it like it's literally doing its magic trick on my face like i can't see it that much can you i feel like whenever i turn my head i can't see it can you see it let's put a little bit more on okay so the magic trick was wonderful and fabulous on my hand but on my face i just can't see anything okay okay so i can see it but it's like I mean, it's beautiful. Like, if you look, like, can you see the pink at this angle? But I feel like at certain angles, it disappears. I mean, it's very strange. Yeah, I mean, I'm liking it, but it's different to any other highlighter that I've ever tried before in that I feel like you have to be looking at it from a certain angle to really be able to see it or, like, see the pink. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know what can you see right now. I mean, it's a really strange one, but I'm liking it. And this is probably why they're called Double Dimension, because they have that, well, not really the peach shimmer one, even though it does look peach and then it does look gold. So it is kind of like a double dimension. But this Lilac Dreams one is like so unique because like at some angles, like you just can't see it. It's not like it's a different color. It's just invisible. So double dimension, like sometimes I'm there, sometimes you can't see me with the human eye. I mean, very peculiar, but I like it. I don't like the lipstick on my teeth though. I mean, when is that going to stop going on my fucking teeth? I mean, really? Okay, so there we go. Oh my gosh, I'm liking it. It's very demure. It's giving me like a really pink nose right now. But um, I, I think these are very interesting I just, I don't like the way, like, I'm getting really distracted by the lips because I, do you ever feel like the darker the lip shade, the smaller it makes your lips appear? And that really pisses me off because I'm always trying to make my lips as big and voluptuous as possible. So, okay, so next I'm going to go and get this super dry, it should be called super dry lipstick. I'm going to get it off. 
hallelujah i mean really and then we're going to try the metallic matte lipstick so just give me one sec and i'll be back oh my gosh so that was one of the hardest liquid lipsticks ever to get off my lips like it was truly stuck on for dear life so how did it even manage to get off on my teeth I have no idea. Next we're going to be trying out the matte metallic which confused me a bit because I wouldn't normally put like matte and metallic next to each other because for me they describe different things you know because matte is matte and then metallic is shiny so I wouldn't normally like think like how could they be the same thing? I don't know. It's in the shade chrome heart and it looks like a rose gold kind of shade. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh, and it makes your lips look so kind of plump and juicy. I love it. It got a horrible smell to it though, like a really bad smell. Okay, so this is what it looks like and I love it. I love it. It's not fully dried down yet. Um, and it does feel ever so slightly kind of dry, but nothing on the scale of the super matte liquid lipstick that I just tried. I love the rose gold kind of metallicness to this. And I just feel like it really makes your lips look, you know, multi-dimensional. Like it makes your lips look kind of plump. Oh gosh. This is absolutely fantastic. Look at that. Oh my gosh, and I know that all of the, you know, big high-end brands are releasing their own version of metallic liquid lipsticks right now, but this, I think, was like £2.50, maybe a push, £3, and it's brilliant. I mean, this is fantastic. It feels comfortable. I mean, you can feel it there. It is a little bit drying, but it's nothing that, it, like, I feel is uncomfortable. Oh my gosh, I love it, guys. I love this. What a huge hit this is. Okay, so I feel like the video has been very positive with the one exception of the super matte liquid lipstick. I'm glad that I gave it another go, but unfortunately I will not be going near the super matte liquid lipsticks again with a barge pole because it's just not for me. I love this. Oh my gosh, like I love it. You're going to be seeing this in many more videos and probably Instagram uh, pictures. I love the peach shimmer highlight. I think it's absolutely beautiful. It's very pretty. I don't actually have anything quite like this in my highlight collection, so I'm very pleased with it. Um, the Lilac Dreams one is bizarre. Like, I don't, I don't understand it. I just don't really get it because at some angles, like, I can't even see it. So it's very mysterious. But I'm intrigued by it. Like, what do you think? I'd be really interested to know what your thoughts are because for me, it's an enigma. I mean, I have no idea what I actually think of it. Um, but I like the fact that it's different and, you know, they're thinking outside of the box. I like that. I commend it. So that brings us to the end of this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you, as always, so much for watching and I will be back soon with more.